Something crazy just happened with Google Maps. We are witnessing a major upgrade with five new AI features. A magical 3D immersive view, personalized AI-powered search, smarter navigation, incredible additions to EV charging stations, and real-world insights with Lens in Map. Trust me, no unnecessary hype or gimmicks here. You just have to see for yourself what these features are all about. Imagine being able to explore anywhere in the world in a realistic and stunning 3D view that makes it look like you are there in person. That's what this first feature is all about. You get to see buildings, streets, landmarks, and key attractions, and peek inside places like restaurants and museums with the immersive view. This feature also gives you more information about the weather and traffic, along with a time slider to help you notice the changes on an entire route throughout the day. It's like the Pro Max version of Google Street View. The idea here is to help you supercharge the way you map and make it easier for you to commute, discover new places, and make really important decisions on where and when to go to a place or do something. Decision making is what we literally do every time as humans, but just how is Google able to do this? You see, the immersive view functions with the aid of neural radiance fields, which transform regular and ordinary looking photos into detailed 3D representations, showing you exactly what a place looks like. Through billions of street views and aerial images that Google Maps has gathered and stored over time, it is able to make the immersive view features a practical experience for users. So how do you leverage this feature? Let's imagine you are planning a trip to a new city and want to get to know the environment better ahead of time. The immersive view literally tells you everything you need to know about this new city and helps you with a better sense of the area at any point in time, so you know just what to expect at that location. It's like virtually walking down a street or having a personal tour guide with you, maybe even better. These 3D views are available in major cities like New York, London, Los Angeles, San Francisco, Tokyo, and a couple of other cities at the moment. You can enjoy them while driving, walking, and cycling. But when you are Google and you know that you're locked in tight competition with Apple, Microsoft, and other major competitors, one feature isn't going to do the trick. So they also came up with this next upgrade. This new feature goes way beyond the basic search function. You see, the future of Google Maps is basically a product that is not only more immersive, but also takes into account your individual preferences. So by analyzing your location, search history, likes, and ratings, Google Maps tailors your search to the tiniest details. On top of that, it goes through reviews and photos from other users and brings you more information about a place. Where am I going with this? Let's say you want to search for coffee shops with latte art nearby, artsy things around your area, or a vegan restaurant, Google Maps can give you information like the opening hours, ratings, prices, and menus. You'd also find user-uploaded photos showing as pins on the map. Essentially, it helps you with better decision-making by providing you with options that align with your taste and budget. You no longer have to be so indecisive about where to go or what to do, because the AI-powered search from Google Maps makes everything a lot easier. Easier. But if your biggest problem is navigating an unfamiliar area, this next Google Maps AI feature might answer all your questions. This improvement in Google Maps uses AI to bring you more precise and useful features for driving, biking, or walking. Some of the most important additions here include lane guidance, which keeps you in the correct lane to avoid missing turns and exits, real-time traffic information to avoid delays and missed meetings, and live views, which make use of augmented reality to overlay information on your camera view and make navigation more intuitive. This AI-driven feature from Google Maps processes large amounts of data from GPS signals, satellite imagery, and user feedback, helping you with up-to-date navigation information. Navigation in Google Maps is literally getting a makeover. Colors have been updated, the buildings are more realistic, and lane details are much better, particularly for those tricky highway exits. US drivers will also get to see HOV lanes with Android, iOS, and cars with Google built-in. There'll also be speed limit information. EV owners are not left out of the party because this next Google Maps AI feature is specifically for them. 
We all know that electric vehicles are growing in popularity, and the demand for accessible charging stations is only going to increase with time. Google Maps has gone into the future to provide detailed information about EV charging stations, their number of charging ports, charger compatibility, types, power level of chargers, availability, speed, and pricing. You also get insights into nearby amenities like restrooms and cafes. Studies show that roughly 25% of chargers are down or in operable at some point in time. So you might ask yourself, is the EV charging station that I'm driving toward actually going to work? Google Maps answers your question by telling you when a charger was last used, so you can figure out if you're wasting your time with a non-operational charger. Because if the station was used a few hours ago, the chances are that it's working. But if it's been a couple of days or weeks since it was used, you might be better off going for another charger. But wait a second. It gets even better for EV owners because Google is offering updated Places APIs to developers to build out these features for cars with navigation systems based on Google Maps. So car companies can make use of these new APIs to give you more and more EV charging information directly on their vehicle's infotainment screens. Finally, we have one of the best AI upgrades we've seen in recent times. Previously known as Search with Live View, this innovative feature transforms your camera view on Google Maps by bringing AI and augmented reality together. How does this happen exactly? Well, Google Maps uses image recognition technology to show you exactly where your destination is, with indicators displayed on top of your in-person camera view. By tapping the lens icon in the search bar and lifting your phone, you get a quick look around. If you're in a supported location, you'll find ATMs, bus or train stations, restaurants, stores, and coffee shops. By pointing your phone at a restaurant, you see details about its name, menu, rating, and availability. You can even order food directly or make reservations. It does the same with landmarks, providing information about history and trivia as well as translation services. If you are a digital nomad exploring new cities or you just happen to be in a new environment, this Google Map feature is something you want to have because of its real-world insights. Lens in Maps is now live in 50 more cities, including Las Vegas, Rome, Sao Paulo, and Austin. The exciting part about these updates is that you do not have to do much to take advantage of them all. The learning curve is quite straightforward, and with a couple of clicks and scrolls, you are good to go. So here's the gist. Google Maps is no longer just a navigation map. It is now more of a companion that helps you explore the world better, thanks to a more immersive experience. Even if your queries are a little vague, and let's say you are asking stuff like things to do in New York, Google Maps provides you with a bunch of actually useful hits under the auspices of its powerful algorithm. Google's plan is to bet on its more popular products like Google Maps to get the edge over its competitors because other map products, like Apple Maps, are finally starting to eat into Google's market share. So, by rolling out these updates and as Google Search becomes more AI-driven, the ultimate goal is to create a product that is more visual and immersive, but one that also helps you make more sustainable choices. But there's just one thing left to ask. Do Google Maps users want all of these extras? I saw some comments on social media where someone said Google is trying desperately to pack too much tech into one product, and that they are at the risk of bloating up and even driving some users away. Personally, I don't think so. I think most people wouldn't mind trying it out, because it doesn't really cost you much in the end. But what are your thoughts on Google Maps AI? Don't forget to like this video and smash that subscribe button. In the meantime, these mind-blowing mid-journey prompts are becoming a real thing. Check out this video for more.